All right, shalom. Before I get started, Barakati Yahawa, Barakati Yahawasha, Barakati Yahawa, Barakati Yahawasha, Barakati Yahawa, Barakati Yahawasha, Kahala Yahawa, Bahashem, Yahawasha, Bahashem, Rakakwadash. Secondly, want to get double honors to the elders, apostles, the great millstone who rule well and teach well, and who are the true leaders of Israel today. Also, like to get double honors. To the head and the elder of the man in Israel camp, the Achza, whom I teach under, down here in Greenville, South Carolina. And I also would like to give another shout out to your sister Akim, your brothers out there that's pushing this truth and our sincerity and righteousness in these latter -end days. And I also would like to give another shout out to your Israelite foreigners that's looking like the other heathen nations cause of confusion, coming back to your heritage in these last days. And another quick shout out to you, if you out watch them, your sisters out there that stand in order and doing what y'all need to do in these latter -end days. To y'all, I like to say shalom. All right, now coming back through the spirit and power, you have by Shia with another uh, exhortation video. And um, so like, yeah, let me put this on the night star. Uh, but I was watching. Um, I wasn't even watching. Uh, I ain't even watched the video. Uh, this is a brother. Uh, he he's in the temple. Uh, he's not in Great Millstone, but. You know he got he got his own camp. Uh, I forget the name of the camp, but they got a camp out there in Tampa, Florida. They was with the uh, camp. They split, but there was once with uh, there was once um, uh, the prophets of Babylon. There was them, but then they split. And I mean, it was just disagreements. Uh, I mean, they still teaching a uh, group. They split from. They still teaching the correct doctrine. Just a little misunderstanding. They just split. You know, I don't know the full details, but. Hey, not that's not the topic but um uh you know the brother had posted you know a video of sakari the camp sakari uh basically saying they don't sin man and uh man if you still watching these guys man you bugged out man and hey man if, if this don't prove to you that sakari is off man i don't know what to say and guess and guess what the only camp that's going to get on them constantly is great millstone Hey, I don't IUIC. Well, shit, IUIC. I'm they I'm pretty sure they 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 agree with uh, Sakari because they 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 uphold the law, statutes, and commandments as well. So I mean, but I mean, how the hell can you even say these guys are man of the Lord? They say they don't sin, bro. Nigga, everybody sins. You know, these guys are false prophets, and y'all stay to give me our money and then just supporting these guys like they just man of the Lord when they not. Now, now you, you you will have some members of Sakari that could be a part of the elect, but they just uh, the Lord just got them sleep right now. You know we don't know how that's we don't know how it's gonna turn out, but hey, we do believe that, that there is somebody elect that's in some of these camps. But I'm gonna tell you right now, I'm not in Great Millstone, but I'm gonna tell you right now, not everybody in Great Millstone gonna make it. Even the elders apostles will tell you the same thing, man. So half the elect gonna. Uh, gonna be in, uh, gonna be in the on in those other camps, or 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 in the uh, or in the offshoot camps, man. That 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 just me personally. I feel like, you know, majority of the elect gonna come from the offshoot camps, and and you know, uh, uh, coming out of those other camps, man. You know, I feel like that's where most of the elect gonna come from. You know, you gonna have you know a good bit come out of Great Millstone as well. But you know, that's just my opinion. You know, I could be wrong. I could be right. Who knows? I'm not saying, you know, that's going to happen, but, hey. But, you know, I'm, I'm going to let y'all hear it, man. Let me make sure my sound. Yeah. I'm going to let y'all hear this madness, man. Bye. Oh, you're not safe. Oh, man. Oh, not a singer. I don't want to see Satan. Oh, there you go. Thank you. So all I'm saying is what you say. All you're saying, everybody's sinner. Listen, that is, po that is possible, that is possible, that is possible to live a sinless life. So you're not saved by your own, not saved by your own. Same thing, man. Right. Like, these things are okay. Is, is that wrong for what I said? Thank you. So all I'm saying is what you say. All you're saying, everybody's sinner. Listen, that is, po that is possible, that is possible, that is possible to live a sinless life. Madness. This nigga just said it is possible to live a sinless life. How? Nigga, we is in captivity. Now, it was in the king. It was in the kingdom, or back in Jerusalem. Hey, yeah, okay, cool. I can see why you said that. But nigga, we not in uh, our kingdom, man. We in captivity, man. Nigga, do you not know that they'd be like, oh, well, we 
we don't we don't commit adultery, you know, we don't break the Sabbath. Nigga, first of all, you do break the Sabbath because you 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 more than likely working on it. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Yeah, and, and and don't and don't and don't them and don't they uh don't those guys uh believe that the Sabbath is they don't believe that the Sabbath is on Friday, Saturday, sundown. So I'm pretty sure <laughs> uh, they follow the new moon Sabbath, right? The new moon Sabbath come in and what? Uh, I mean the Sabbath come in whenever the new moon hit, man. So whatever the new moon is for that month, hey, that's when the Sabbath is gonna be. So you telling me all they congregation just take off for the Sabbath? Come on, man. So y'all niggas do sin, man. You know, and, and they might they might say, well, I don't do it. Those brothers might do it. So why you ain't getting on them then? <laughs> y'all 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 supposed to be living sinless, right? So why you not getting on them? Why you not getting on your members, man? You see, you see what I'm saying? Not only that, the pork situation, nigga. You don't know what food ingredients got pork in it. And not only that, when when they cooking your meat, because I used to work at the damn, uh, uh, I used to work at a grocery store. And they cut the meat with the same fucking tools, man. Or the same uh, utensils, man. Or whatever they cut it with, man. You know? They put pork on the table and you might think, oh, I got turkey. It ain't no pork. But that 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 uh that turkey might have touched that pork. You see? You, you ate it. So that means you got that means you sin. So what the fuck is these guys talking about? It's possible to leave a live a sinless life. How? In this captivity. How? These niggas are gone, man. I'm gonna get some scriptures backing it up, man. These niggas are fucking through. And you still watching these. Matter of fact, before I even. Uh, Matthew 15 and 14. It said, let them alone. They be blind leaders of the blind. And if the blind lead the blind, both shall fall into a ditch. Let me, let me read that one more time. Matthew 15 and 14. Let them alone. They be blind, they be blind leaders of the blind. And if the, and if the blind lead the blind, both shall fall into a Fall into the ditch. You see that? Th th those 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 guys, Sakari, those Sakari guys, they blind leaders, and they blinded the, the uh, they blinded the uh, the 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 uh, the uh, the sheep, man. You see? And guess what? The scripture said they should both fall into a ditch. You see? These y'all niggas gotta wake the hell up to see that these guys ain't right, man. They are blind leaders, and they blinding y'all, man, by telling y'all that it's possible. To live a sinless life It's not They sending they damn self You see They sending they goddamn self man You know But telling they congregation They don't sin They want to look perfect Before man You see But Yahweh Shai Yahweh Bashi Yahweh Shai He know they, they, they uh, He know they uh, How they uh, get down man You know But to man They want to look All godly and stuff Oh we don't sin We perfect Nigga ain't nobody perfect In the law Besides Yahweh Shai, that's why he was that. That's why he was the one that had to be that ultimate sacrifice. And not nigga, you should have got your ass on that cross, nigga. But you didn't. You didn't. Dumbass, nigga. Uh, Isaiah chapter sixty-four and verse six. Let me drink some of this water real quick. Bear me one second. All right, Isaiah chapter 64 and verse 6. And it says, <clears throat> it says, but we are all as but we are all as an unclean thing, and all our righteousness are as filthy rags. And we all do fade as a leaf, and our iniquities like the wind have taken us away. You see that? It says, but we are but we are all everybody not <laughs> The, the, this applies to Sakar? Yes, it does. I should uh, comment on that video, but I ain't even gonna do it, man, because it, it's gonna be a waste of time. You know, it's gonna be a waste of time. You know, only thing we can do is is, is, is do the videos and lower well, and the sheep don't be deceived, man. That's the only thing we can do because going back and with going back and forth, with these guys ain't gonna go nowhere. They not more than likely they're not gonna change. Our elders apostles done got on these niggas multiple times, man. And they still didn't. If I was apostles can't do it, what the fuck makes you think we can? I mean, I ain't saying that it ain't possible, but damn, you know. But it says, uh, but we are all as unclean things, and all our righteousness are as filthy rags. You see, all our righteousness are as filthy rags, man. We filthy. We covered in sin, man. You see, we like a pig that's just rolling around in mud. 
You know how pig just roll around in mud, just nasty, filthy. That's just like how we is. We covered in it, man. We covered in all this sin. Bro, it, bro, there's not a day that goes by that we don't sin, man. Just by the fucking clothes we wear, man. You know? Just that alone. And they might say, well, we got 100% cotton. N nigga, no, you don't. You don't know that shit 100% cotton, nigga. You didn't put the cotton in there. Esau could just easily say, oh, well, you know, it might say 100% cotton, but it's mixed fabric. You know, you're not supposed to have mixed fabric. But Esau says 100% cotton, though. You see? It says, but we are all as an unclean thing. But we are all as an unclean thing. And all our righteousness are as filthy rags. And we all do fade as a leaf. And 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 we all do fade as a leaf in our iniquities. Like the wind have taken us away, man. You see that? So every all of us have sent, man. Point blank period, man. If you say you never sinned, man, you tripping, you bugging out. You know? You're really tripping. Uh Romans three and twenty three. It says, matter of fact, I'm going to come back to that. 1 John 1 and 8. If we say that we have no sin, we deceive ourselves. And the, tru and the truth is not in us. So guess what? The truth is not in Sakari. The truth is not in Sakari. They got half of the truth. But the whole truth is not in Sakari, man. You know? These niggas are telling y'all that they never sinned. And what the scripture say? If we say that we have no sin, we deceive ourselves. So Sakari, they deceiving their own goddamn selves, man. You know, they deceiving their own selves by telling y'all that they never sin, man. Because everybody has sin, especially in this captivity that we in, man. We is in captivity. You telling me you never sin, bro? Get the fuck out of here, man. Well, I ain't gonna say they never sin, but they saying that they 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 live the sinless sinless life. You know. So it said, let me read it one more time. First John, first John chapter one and verse eight. If we say that we have no sin, we deceive ourselves and the truth is not in us. So anybody and whoever saying they never sinned, guess what? The truth is not in them, man. Point blank period. I don't care how much wisdom, knowledge and understanding they got in the scriptures. If they say they never sinned, man, they going off and they don't got the truth. Point blank period, man. And we're going to end it with this. Romans chapter 3 and verse 23 and it says Romans chapter 3 and verse 23 and it says for all let me start that back for all have sinned and come short of the glory of the heavenly father man hey that's hey man hey you can't get around that, man. It said, for all have sinned, man, and come short of the glory. So even that means, Sakar, you niggas fell short, man. Point blank period, man. You niggas fell short, man. So y'all niggas need to stop that shit. Y'all niggas need to stop telling people. Y'all niggas need to stop telling people y'all never sinned, man. Or y'all can live a sentence like Salakia. Because it's very much, I mean, it's very much possible we just still sinning in this life that we living in. So with that, we're going to end it. Yahweh Rats is out of this video. Was that a fine? I'm going to close it. We're giving our praise and glory to Yahweh Bahashem. Yahweh Shai Bahashem. Rechak Shalom until next time. Shalom.